What's up, everybody? I'm the Vernon Sky Clan, and welcome back to Spear Fear Fear Will Edition. Oh, yeah, and we were last here with Olga. Olga, say hello. Hello. Welcome back to Spirit Fearer Farewell Edition. But then, you already did that, didn't you? Yeah, sorry, I didn't know that you were going to be popping up. It's quite alright. Ouch! What the hell? Stella! I... I... I didn't do nothing wrong, alright? It was just these gosh darn little second critters. What'd you do, Jackie? They just lashed out at me. Bunch of lunatics? I'm caring for you all, alright? You'd all be dead if I didn't care for you. I should just pump him all full, all full of smoke and dump him off the boat. The little, the gosh darn, the, 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 the bees. You know, I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting slashy in the vibes from Jackie. I don't know why. Shit. <laughs> Shit. I'm, I'm doing it again, aren't I? It's Dario all over again. They're just bees. They can't do anything wrong. You seem to have an issue when things don't go the way you want them to. Like when others don't cooperate with you, you get hot, you get hot and bothered. Don't you, Jackie? And Daria, she's she's just Daria. Mm. Huh. I don't know why I get like that, Stella. Sometimes. Sometimes something happens. Hmm. Anything. A big noise, someone says something I don't like, or has got an attitude, or has a bad attitude. And I just. It just gets so overwhelming. It feels like I'm drowning, and I can't breathe, and I can't think. Hmm. I just start seeing red, and then I barely remember what happened. I want to change, Stella. You gotta believe me. Please. I just... I don't know how. Be yourself. Shut up, sheep. Oh. I thought I could do it by myself. But obviously, I... Yeah. I'm a chump. I know it. Jackie the Loser. Don't think I haven't heard that one before. Mm -hmm. Can't do anything right. Always messing up. Just... I... I need some time alone. I can't talk to you right now. Am I... Am I safe? that there for right now. Hmm. Well... I'm an ogre. Guess she just kind of vanished out of existence. That or we just turned the ship around and we're going t straight towards Francis. Because there's still... A few things left for us to do. Hi, Daffodil. Wow! Hi, Lily. How's the family? Wait, you can talk? Apparently so! Huh. That actually is 
Le oh, there it is, Elena's lesson. And Elena's demand. Okay. Salary in. Okay, so all this time I've been trying to figure that out. Now that I know what I'm doing... Alright, Francis. We are good now. Now I know what I'm doing. Another beautifully prepared stir stroming. One might welcome death after such a forgettable meal. Hmm. Oh. Hum. oh. 
Out Harbor really got upgraded. That didn't take too long. Dive it down. The sun in the air. I can finally breathe. Wow, it looks amazing. Oh. Good job, Hummingbird Preservation Society. Oh. This place is livable now. I could eat off these rocks. Oh, off those rocks. It's so clean. Yeah. The figures. Wow. Small glim bottle. Hmm. I can't believe the work they did. Wow. Oh! Jackie! Hey! Hey, hey Stella! We, we need to have a talk. Oh. I'm not doing good, Stella. Like, not at all. I know I act tough and all. Oh. But truth be told, I don't think I've ever been doing good. Shit. Mm. You know, you really do get on my nerves sometimes. Always so happy or caring. Just sparkly. No. I don't know how you do it. I've seen those people you care for. I know them because I've cared for them too. No. And yeah, sure. Some of them are nice and all. But most of them part of my language, they're assholes. Nitpicky. Demanding. Rude. Well, I mean, they don't know any better, right? Mm. But you. Everything seems to just glide over you. Some old cuckoo yells at you because their pudding's the wrong color and you just... You just smile. Softly. Gently. <laughs> Always. Mm. And then you magically fix the, the situation. You're always the first to arrive, the last to leave. And I've never heard you badmouth in a patient. Mm -hmm. As for me, I... Uh, oh. I need help, Stella. Whenever I try to get better on my own, I just wind up sliding back in a dark place. And I'm so sick of being angry all the time. Oh. I think it's time I stop kidding myself. I'm not a caretaker. I can't even take care of myself. So, you know, guess you have a new patient now. Mm. I'm sorry to be a burden like that. Not that I know of any other way to live. So, now that the hard thing's been said, mm. my room, it's a little bare, don't you think? I want a fresh start, but I'm not sure a naked jail cell is the way to go. Mm. When I think of something, I'll just ask you straight. No games. For the moment, though, could you get me, like, some posters or something? Mm. I can't stand the concrete walls anymore. I really need them covered up. I feel like I'm getting cabin fever in there. Mm -hmm. I'm almost at the make a girlfriend out of mashed potatoes point right now. Sure thing, Jax. Motivational posters. That was awesome. The office of Caspar Crayford. Thank you, dear reader. You are among a rare breed of adventurers. One of the only to ever brave the seas and recover the lost bounties of Crows and Incorporated. As a token of your dedication, here is a lifetime membership to the famed Master Adventurers Guild. We welcome you with open arms. Thank you for 
for you, you, your own dungeon re support. Casper Crayboard, dictated but not read. <laughs> what? Proof of your, proof of your worth as an adventurer. Certified by Luther's Literary Review. Nice. All right, well. can do at this moment with it. I'm sure it's nothing. I guess I'm gonna be doing a lot of fishing in this episode now. Because there are fish that I need. Get me, Stella. I've been feeling down. But with this, I'll be doing so much better. Be right there, Alex. Feed me. No. Let's see what that does. Down the water. <laughs> you silly. All right, Alex, get us over there. Huh? <laughs> Had to be cold, huh? Yep. Uh huh? See what this kind of honey does. Lokma. That's right. I haven't used honey well enough. All right. Let's go fishing. Do 
two salmon. Yay! I need so many more. Now this feels just like back in Stardew. and extravaganza oh, medium glim bottle doesn't help when I get glims wow that was great for a good while No crab, all right. I need a lot of them. I think I remember, yeah, I need, I need a lobster. Thought I'd be back here fishing again. fish I got this time. Char. Where do I get the red eye socket fish? I hope everyone's enjoying the music. Come on now. Here, fishy, fishy fish. Who's salmon? Now, I'm gonna look up Spirit fair fish. Because each, um, because I'm pretty sure that each fish is in a specific area. Socket fish doesn't seem to be anywhere around. The Calstine mines. Just keep on fishing then. Later, Alex! Oi, oi. I'm gonna have a lot of blue salmons here. Awesome fishing in the sea at night in the wintry section. Probably another char. Get her in. Yeah. 
Oh, uh, I don't, I don't remember your name, but not right now. Yeah, that's it. Get a good lot of honey. There we go. Snow cab. No, sometimes you just gotta stop and enjoy. Just doing this kind of stuff. It's peaceful. Lobster, I know I need lobster. I have to check back in with uh, Francis. That looks like it's gonna be a char. How did I know that? Probably because the char like goes like the red goes away like super quick. One more snow crab. That moon's not gonna last forever. I... I, what I want to say about this game, um, I'll leave for the ending. Okay, I got the snow crabs that I need. Oh, wow. Okay. Francis is nowhere to be seen. But since I'm here, I might as well go and make some honey based foods. And considering the fact that Jackie wanted honey.
I get the feeling that he loves honey based items. <laughs> Alright, so the, no, the real question is where is that octopus? Oxbury. Alright. That's the bus stop. And to Oxbury will go. Daisy. Sup, good morning. Ah, I don't believe we had the pleasure of meeting. Yeah, name's Jackie. Ah. And I am Gustav. Absolutely. Yeah, pleasure's all mine. So, iron and bronze. Gotcha. Be right with you, Alex. I got some place to be. Bowl. All right, now I gotta wait for the next. <laughs> I harvested some honey. Take it. Well, thank you. This will make. Two Oxberry. Ah, ba da ba da. All right. Oxberry, we go. I noticed your crew's gotten really small lately. Not a lot of activity anymore. Yeah. It's pretty much the. It's pretty much it. Mm, I see, I see. a long time and I don't want my food to get burnt. It's time to make some new foods. Octopus. And a squid. And I think that's it. But there's something that says about a red eye socket. That's a little weird. I know Daphs. Oh, okay. More cereal bowls. So any kind of wheat makes cereal bowls. It's a clear crystal day. A good day for fishing. I wonder what fish I'll be able to get this t today. 
A flounder. Oh, I caught flounder from Little Mermaid. Who's up for fish? Growth fish. Or even some strongman or whatever you call it. That seems to be another. Cut oh, a cuttlefish. Oh, I know that there are octopuses here. Ah, the mahi mahi is pretty quick. But where is the octopus? The octopus is here, right? I guess it's just a percent ratio for me to get it. I don't need flounder, I need octo. King salmon. Now this might actually help, con uh, considering the fact that I'll be able to complete more of Susan's quest. Ugh, Susan. We don't talk about Susan. No, no, no. Where's my dang it octopus? Octopus sure likes to be a nuisance to me. Ooh, that was close. Wait, let me see. Let me see. Because I know I need octopus. No, no such information. No, oh, so I guess it doesn't really matter. So long as the weather's clear. Okay. Then that is what I'll do. I'll just keep fishing until I get an octopus. That was close. I thought the line was about to snap. Oh, those oh, those octopus are fast. Okay. Octopus because it's not speed. It's not real speed. Those octopus seem to have be a lot less capturable. Second octopus, yay! And how many do I need? I need like three. See, the thing is, finding is so tedious that yeah, I don't know. It, I just I got so sick and tired of it.
That was quick. Well, I got four anyway, so... I wonder if there's anybody on... Oh, I don't know. There's no one on Oxbury. Where's... Where's Francis anyway? Oh, yeah. I don't know where I was going. Or where I thought I was going. No, no, hang on. I was going to the smithy. That was easy. Speed like the wind, baby. <laughs> Let's see. So five iron ingot. Abigail, this way. Okay, someone that keeps talking, I don't know who. Oh man, this is gonna be hard. The bees are done. Ah, okay. That should that, that, that should keep it. Leaves are not quite ready yet. I keep forgetting that I don't need to put in as many. What does this make? Sweet honey tea? Yeah, sweet honey milk? Ah, toffee. <laughs> that was all sleep until morning. Maybe I'll get Francis over here faster. <laughs> Do you need my assistance? Or any assistance? <sighs> Be the change that you want for the life inside of you don't bother, no second guessing. Well, he's got one good thing. Francis moves about whenever he wants to. 
See? Francis, where are you? I'm gonna go see if there's anybody else on Oxbury who might need assistance. Because you never know. You never know. Oh, that's why I never saw Daria's uh, spirit flower. Oh, snap! Did you see that sick move? I caught it. I'd never I thought I didn't collect it <laughs> and where's my guy hey mm. have I been enjoying my time at Overbrook not really everyone is so mean to me <laughs> they keep calling me names like trashy or piles you know mm. names related to picking up trash you probably already figured that out. I do enjoy picking up other people's trash, but it still hurts. Mm -hmm. I don't like it when people call me mean names. Very few people like that, I suppose. This job would be great if they would just stop talking trash to me. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I'm the one doing it now. I just want them to treat me with a little bit of respect. Give a little... Give a little bit, give a little bit, give a little bit, give a little bit, so... Give a little respect to my man. Or at the very least, not talk to me. Mm. Would you mind telling me to stop? Telling them to stop, not me. That would make my days a bit better. Journey, journey to the core. <laughs> These guys have not found their cat. Oh. Don't you just love it when everything is clean? I'm talking clean clean. Like eating off the floor clean. Oh. Something to be proud of. Like you can see reflections, so it's so it's so clean. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I'm definitely gonna dream about clean floors tonight. Oh. When does something actually become trash? Oh. Well, is it? Is it what? I don't know. What are you talking about? Stop being crazy. Ooh. I got hired by an external firm to do some cleaning here. I don't actually work for the hospital, but I but I only work here. Ooh. That's a bit strange, ain't it? I don't get benefits or anything like that. If I get hurt on the job, job they just fire me. The other, day, the other day, Marcus slipped on some fluid, broke his wrist. The hospital didn't even want to treat him. Ooh. He just went home. I, need, I haven't seen him in a while. I just know he's not on the calendar anymore. Mm. Well, I better look out for any fluid or something. Gotta be extra safe out here. I guess he's dead. Deader than dead. Ha. Head doctor. I haven't talked to every single person. Down or up? Thank you again. There's work to do, but this is a good start. Dabby-do. Oh. Hot stuff, coming through. Then who is the head doctor? Oh. We're gonna do a lot of good with this food. Thank you again. Oh. 
damn, that's so weird. I see, he's on the balcony, but I didn't see the guy anywhere. So many people get sick. Oh. I've got a hard time remembering which species go spices go where. What's the difference between the t thyme and rosemary? Besides the name, oh. obviously. Do I have to taste them to figure that out? I don't want to taste weird people, weird food plants. Oh. Hi there. Oh, you're the doctor. Yeah, I want to report some name calling going on what mm -hmm. oh trashy doesn't like being called names well that's news to me i really thought we had a report really mm -hmm. i would produce trash he would pick it up i would call him a trash related name we had this whole bit i'm a bit shocked really mm -hmm. i'll try and be better at reading social cues next time hmm i just feel awful now mm -hmm. what should i do well Money has always been the answer for me. Oh, you're that doctor. But trash with this trashy, I mean, well, I actually don't know his name. Oh. I will find that out first thing in the morning. In the meantime, I should do something nice for him. Hmm. Got it. Oh. You should go give him something healthy. That always cheers me up. An apple, maybe. Oh. I know it sounds expensive, but it's organic and so healthy for you. I eat like 12 a day. Wait a minute. If an apple a day keeps the doctor away, what would happen if a doctor ate an apple a day? We're 12, to be precise. Huh. I guess I'll never know. That's why I'm so vibrant and fit. Ooh. I'm sure he'll love it. He always rambles on about eating healthy and producing his own food. Who has time for that? Ain't nobody got time for that. Mm. Not me, but you know, everyone's got a thing. So here's some money, just in case. Just go see him with an apple. Mm. I'm sure things will be fine after that. Thanks. You do realize that I've been growing apples on my boat, on my ship. You can do that? My, what a... What a rock, what a sheltered life you've lived, Doc. Oh, wow. Mm. What? Yeah, I don't want you dumb rich people, Apple. If he thinks a fruit bought with dirty money will make things better, mm. he's completely delusional. But look at the scenery. There's a garden here now. Mm. Nature completely overtook these runes. This looks amazing. It's so beautiful and... Oh, just smell the air. So fresh. This is way better than some stupid fruit or whatever. I heard rich people's apples were actually made of recycled apples. You know I grow my own apples, right? You do? <laughs> Mixed in with, like, dirty magazines, little rocks, used water, etc. You know, the gross stuff. What I enjoy about rich people is the way they spend their money. Ooh. On dumb things. Well, well. I don't know how this overgrown garden popped up. Mm. It sure makes my la little field with the doctor pretty inconsequential. Inconsequential. He can call me whatever he wants. I don't care. Mm -hmm. I've got a garden now. I'm clearly better than him. Whoa, look at the splendor. Mm -hmm. Nature really makes things better, doesn't it? Jackie. Okay. I think I've been playing long enough. Let's see if Francis is nearby. That guy shows up when he least ex when I least expect him to. Thank you. Goodbye, Charon, Vendor 
machine. If oh, imagine if Charon got reborn as a venom machine. That would be interesting. Before I talk to good old Jackie, I'm gonna go see what I have and don't have with. Francis, what do I got here? Too many items on the menu. Oh, look at that! I got more than enough. Fifteen thousand. Got a lot to go with uh, the gardening. Alright, but anyway, I'm gonna leave this episode here for right now. Did a lot of fishing, got a lot of fish. So I'm pretty happy about that. Mm. So now I just gotta do some gardening. But in the meantime, Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please like, comment, and share. And don't forget to subscribe to see more in the future. I'll catch you later.